Hi guys, so I am listening to some worship music tonight um, and the kids, all my mom, honestly you guys, such a good help, such a big help. I had a Bible study tonight that I went to and the kids, I had also went to, Leah, what? The? No, 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 Leah, no, that's gross. Here, wipe your mouth on me. Don't do that. Don't do that, okay? Don't do that. Um... <laughs> it's funny how gross kids are but um what's it called we went to i went to Bible study and the kids stayed with my mom and then they got a bath i've been back for a while but um i was i came down here to start cleaning my room because it's a mess and i need to start a laundry and i just need to clean up and i just need to like feel refreshed i don't go into work till two tomorrow so i'm actually gonna try to do something with my life um but i just need to clean up so my mom helped me bathe the kids and she's bathing or she's showering anthony she bathed lilia and i just love people like take it in i'm taking it in just taking it in i'm thanking god for what he's given me um so i have been so late on these vlogmas videos but i'm still gonna put them up because guess what so what uh, better late than never so that's why i'm still gonna upload them and i'm just gonna do this quick like one take today because i need to do this for you guys um today was pretty good um i went to work it was really good actually work was really good i came home had a great bible study and then i'm having a good time with the kids um tonight i'm probably just gonna read them this story right here which is the first christmas night and it's just that um so i'm probably just gonna read them that um anthony and i had some studying to do for his school and it just makes my heart so full to see him actually want to learn because whenever I was growing up I hated school like I hated I mean I don't think I hated school because I, I remember for a little bit like I liked learning but I was just such a, a timid kid I know it's hard to believe um but I was like so shy and I was just so scared and I was just um I grew up in an abusive home if you guys don't know um so I relate my childhood to his and it makes my heart so full that he actually wants to learn and I remember whenever my dad would like or whenever my mom would sit down with us and try to teach us something and we didn't understand and like you know she would have to repeat it over and over and over again I remember my dad would like come in sometimes and like he would make it so like he was just so mean like he would hit us um if we didn't know something like it wasn't just it wasn't patient and so whenever i have the opportunity to teach anthony something um i try to do it like in a loving way of course i have my moments where i'm like come on you, you can do this like like you're, you're not trying your hardest of course in those moments is where i'm just like okay well you don't want to do it we're gonna just stop here and you know we'll close it um but i like today i was t i was like going over his words um and or his letters sorry not le words i was going over his letters and he wanted them he wanted them in order because it's easier for him of course for anybody um if his letters were in order and like they were like flashcards, and i was like you know showing it to him and he was getting upset with me because i wasn't doing them in order he's like i want them in order mom and i'm like well do you do you really want them in order or do you want to challenge yourself if you challenge yourself you're going to be so much more proud of yourself because i know you can do this and he like he um he didn't want to do it at first but i'm like let's just try it and you're gonna you're gonna do great like you, you can do this i know you can so i like mix up the cards and we started doing it and he knew every single letter that i pulled out he would be like lowercase a um or uppercase a you know it's just like he knew it and i was so proud of him and just like his enthusiasm to be organized and to have his stuff together at such a young age amazes me and makes me a proud proud mom so i'm just having to brag on on my baby because he is such a good kid and for a little bit like i like i tell people like i've struggled to be where i am right now like there are there were days where i would get a note or uh and i told you guys about this like on my weekly vlogs where i would like get bad reports over him and it wasn't because he was like a bad kid he just had bad moments where he would like bite a kid or he would talk back to the teacher and um I had to remember he wasn't the only like it's normal for them to do that at that age and I was like taking it as he was the only one doing it but the teacher like I sat down with the teacher so many times and she's like Leslie like he's not the only kindergartner who does this stuff like it's normal but we have to let the parents know so that they can change something and they can like do something at home and help them and like hi Tony did you take a shower take a shower so um i've worked i've worked a ton with my child and he's doing pretty hi good in school are you doing good in school yeah are you doing good in everything that I you just, do i just got a shower you did get a shower um so i'm just really proud of uh, like i'm i'm proud i'm happy i'm thankful i'm very very thankful today um for 
just like the blessings for the hard times um, because last time if, if Anthony didn't go, let me let me just finish, okay? Mommy, what baby? Let me tell them my Hold story on. first. Okay, let me finish because I was telling them something. Okay, just let me finish. So yeah, I'm just thankful for the hard times because without <laughs> the hard times, I wouldn't be able to look at these good times and be like I'm more proud like without the challenges in life I would have okay honey hold on here sorry. okay without the challenges in life I wouldn't be more like proud of what he has become and what you know so I'm just I don't know does it all tie together I hope it does because I'm just my heart is so full today and I'm just so happy today and um I'm so proud and I'm thankful for the challenges even though on those frustrating days where I would get a phone call and be like hey your son's not doing very good today and I wanted to cry and I wanted to scream and I wanted to like I would tell myself how horrible of a mom I was to now where his teacher's like he's doing better he's doing a lot better I'm glad you're working with him I'm glad you know and it just feels good it feels good to know that I'm not putting my time my effort everything into something that's not changing I mean look at this kid he like he's absorbs everything that I teach him like Aaliyah too but it's just amazing to see it unfold in this little kid right here because he has the ability to show me what he's learned and it's so rewarding it is so rewarding and like I wonder if that's how my mom feels about me now because for a little bit I was struggling with you know everything in life and I feel like I think now she looks at me and she's like she gets it she gets it and I hope she feels proud of me but I'm very proud of this kid and I just want to say it. I'm so thankful. Make sure to hug your kids. Love them. Extra, extra. You know, make good choices for them. Because they deserve it. I'm very proud of this one. So what do you want to say? Uh, well, I used to be bad in school, but now I started... I, I had a bad behavior, but then I started to have good behaviors on the next day of school and and then so that's whenever I got good and so and it's okay and, you, and, you so, have... and so I have learned so much in school I, I am proud of myself today we went down to the computer lab then we we were lucky because we went to the Santa store and then and then tomorrow we're going to the Santa store, so good luck. <laughs> Bye. Uh, and it's okay to have bad days, huh? Like, Mommy always tells you that, right? Like, sometimes we have bad days. Sometimes we wake up on the wrong side of the bed, and we have bad days, and that's okay uh -huh, sometimes. Your breath smells gross. <laughs> I'm sorry. I am so sorry about that. Does it really smell gross? Or are you just playing because you're trying to be cool? No, it just smells gross. I don't think it smells gross. I think it does. Did you even... I, I mean, it, I think it smells fine. It's not that bad. Are you exaggerating? <laughs> are you exaggerating? Because I don't think my... <laughs> you just got really close to my mouth. Okay, well, this is a one take, Anthony, so all of this is going to stay there. And I really don't care if my breast stings right now because, you know, we're going to bed. I'm going to brush my teeth anyway, so. Mommy. Yeah. Stop. Okay. Well, do you want to tell them thank you for watching this one take Bye. vlog, Miss Day? Bye. <laughs> Bye. Say thank you for watching our vlogmas videos. Ha <laughs> no. Yes. You do it. Why me? When I have you. <laughs> you. Okay. Thank you guys so much for watching Vlogmas Day 7 because Anthony doesn't want to help me close this one. <laughs> so thank you guys so much for watching and we will talk to you later tomorrow. Hey, I said later. Don't forget to subscribe and click the, the down below button to see more of my channels again if you want to. Yeah. You want to see more of that cute face right there. <laughs> yeah. Mommy! Duty, duty. Okay, so we're gonna go now. Bye, guys. Do you wanna say bye? Bye! <laughs>